Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Carolyn and her clothes. This is my fourth video. <laughs> so I finished up my outfit of the day, finished up my trend send, finished up my stitch fix, and that's three. So now here we're doing a couple of purchases that I purchased last weekend. So I returned that um, eyelet blue and white stripe puff sleeve with a little big ruffles at the end at loft. And you knew I couldn't come out of there empty handed. I don't know how the rest of you work the loft, but when I go into the loft, I have to go through the store three times. Not once, not twice, but I go around three times. <laughs> and I, so every time I go around that store, I find something I might've missed the previous time. So I don't have much to show you. Um, it's not that I didn't like things, but I'm trying to be cognizant of things that I've already owned in my wardrobe. All right, so the first thing I got was just this basic yellow tank. I really like the color and it is, I like their tanks. I think they're good quality. I think they fit well. I will style this for you. It won't be anything exciting. Matter of fact, I'll style all three of these pieces for you, but I'm not going to go crazy with the styling on it. So this tank was originally $26.95. I got it for $16.17, okay? So I thought it's a pretty color. I have it in the green, I have it in a coral, and now I have it in the yellow. And I have, um, from prior years, I think black, white, and hot pink. <laughs> so I like them, why not, right? All right, this, this next item was my third time around find. All right, so this is a coral sweater with this boat neck style top, has the puff sleeves, um, has kind of different knitting here along the neckline. Okay, banded bottom. Notice the, the shape of it. It is not a box. It actually has some shape and goes towards the bottom more. I definitely like that type of style sweater. I know there's a little bit of point tail stitching here on the side as well too. And this sweater was originally, let's find it over here, originally uh, $54.95 and I got it for $32.97. And, you know, I originally when I wasn't going to get this, but I charge on, I'm like, oh, that's cute. And I'm like, oh, am I going to regret not putting, getting that sweater? Yes, Carolyn, you're going to regret it and you're going to be sad. So I decided to buy it. Now, here it is. It's a week later. And when I was shopping at the store, they had some really cute dresses. Matter of fact, I texted Kayla. I'm like, if you have any dresses in your cart, they're, they're really cute ones. And I talked myself out of trying on the dresses because I simply don't wear dresses in my lifestyle. I'm very casual. I don't go anywhere, but boy, did they have some cute dresses. So they're in the back of my head now. I don't have time this weekend, I don't think, to run up there, but possibly next weekend or the weekend after that, um, I'm gonna have to go back up there and try on those dresses because they were so cute. There was a beautiful green one, a patchwork one. Oh, they were so pretty. Not necessarily for work. Be, I can make them more casual with the pair, like a wedge heel, but um, you know, I don't know. I. I I don't know when I'm wearing them, but I really do like them. All right, in that same shop, shopping center is White House Black Market, and there's a story here. They sent me a $30 off uh, your purchase, so of course I had to use that. And Laura um, showed on Little Wax of Happy, showed this gorgeous color. The color is the Zelia Blazer. Now, I love that color, but I don't want to buy a blazer. I just, again, my lifestyle is a little bit more casual. Um, I didn't want a blazer, but I knew, and I've seen this in store before, and I was tempted to buy it earlier. So it is a top. Now, the reason why I didn't buy it earlier, one thing is the price, because full price, let's see, that's off, oh, it's getting backwards. Full price, this top is $89, all right? And again, I had 30 off. Um, it's a lot for this top, in my opinion. Number two, the reason why I didn't get this top is I actually own this top, but in a different color from last year, and I kind of have that no duplicates rule. And my no duplicates rule goes for a style and also colors, because I don't want like the same exact thing. Um, I like to have variety in my wardrobe, but I really like this color. So literally, I was there holding this the shirt in my hand at White House Black Market, and I headed toward the register. And then I went back and put it back. And then I kept going towards the register. And I went with it back. I think I did it like three times. And I said to myself, Carolyn, if you don't walk out of the store with this top, are you going to be sad? And the answer was, yeah, I, I am going to be sad. So I didn't want to be sad. So I ended up getting the top. 
So I broke one of my own rules. They did have to order it for me. They didn't have a size extra small in store. So they ordered it me and it came this week. I love this color. And I know this fits because I have it in green. I'll try it on just to be sure, you know, but this color is gorgeous. And look at, look at this color. So this is a, like a peplum, little peplum style. It's fitted across the top and it has a V-neck. And in the back, it has this cute little design. And like I said, I have the same thing in mint green from last year, but this, this, is, this is gorgeous. I love this. All right, so give me a minute and I'll try it on for you and how I would style these. It's not gonna be anything exciting, but you know, it's how I'd wear it. So give me a Okay, first up is very casual. I got on the yellow tank, the Ever Eve jeans, which I still haven't taken the tags off, which I just decided to keep today. My Gola uh, sneakers that I got from a Stitch Fix. And the jacket is from Banana Republic, I think the outlet circa 2018. And this is how I'd wear this tank. I'll take the, the top off so you can see. I am wearing my Soma racer back bra, so it does cut in a little bit in the back, as you can see. So I use a racer back bra to account for that. And I think it's a, a great basic tank. They fit well under the armpits. This is an extra small. Obviously, if you don't like them form fitting, size up, but I like this. I think it's a great layering piece and also great for the dog days of summer. All right, give me a minute. I'll pop on the next outfit. Top number two is the White House Black Market Top with the cute little peplum bottom. Peplums can kind of be tricky on me, but I think this one works because of where it hits. It's going here in my smallest part of the waist and it's not flaring out too much. It's laying flat. Love this color. Like I said, I have the same top in mint green. Here is the back of it. I took the easy way out and I styled them with the same exact jeans I was wearing and I slipped on my Dolce Vita sandals and please excuse my toes are not summer ready yet. Um, if I were to get chilly, I would throw on the same white denim jacket. Uh, I would also mix it up and pair these with white jeans and a light wash denim jacket as well too. But like I said, I took the lazy way out, had these on and I'm probably going to style it the same way with the third outfit. So give me a minute. Okay, here's the third top, and this is the loft sweater in coral. Let you guys know, this is 100% cotton. It is, um, again, the uh, embroidery here across the top and the banded cuff here. And yeah, I mean, I have to say this does run a little small, particularly across my chest, nothing crazy, but it is a little bit snug, but I didn't want to size up because I felt there was plenty of room and fabric here. Um, but yeah, I like this top. I think it's really cute. Here's the back of it. And I, again, I would either probably pair this with white jeans and a lighter denim jacket or the denim jeans and a white jacket. And this is how I'd wear this. Or I'd even wear it with maybe, you know, tan pants as well too. All right, well, thank you very much for sticking around and seeing what I purchased. I appreciate your support. If you haven't subscribed yet, what's holding you back? Click that notification bell to get notified of future videos for me and give me a thumbs up. Take care and until next time.